welcome back to our channel. I think, I guess this is the first video of the new year. So happy new year. Hope you guys had a great new year. Hope you guys had a great Christmas. If you guys hear noise in the back, it's Amara crying per usual. I've been trying to make this video for the last 30 minutes, okay? But um, anyway, so I actually, you know what? When I was trying to make the video, I was actually going to, well, I was, you know, showing you guys the different grocery hauls. You guys can see by the title. This is a grocery haul, but I forgot to tell y'all the great news. So I had to delete everything and start over because I want to tell y'all the good news. Um, I don't think I told y'all. If I did, then just act like you already heard this. But I don't believe I told y'all. I got the job. Did I tell y'all that already? I don't think I told y'all that already. I think my last video was the Christmas video. Okay, so did I tell you? I don't know. I can't remember. No, I didn't because I found out last week and that was after Christmas. So yeah, I got the job. So that is so exciting. Y'all know if you have been on this journey with me throughout my whole work situation, then you know that this has been so exciting for me. Um, I told y'all the situation would happen with the job or whatever as far as I applied for one uh, position, but they said, hey, you're better for this one. I was like, oh, I was kind of bummed, but it ended up working out and yeah, I don't understand. I'm so, I'm so happy. I'm so excited. Um, so with that being said, I think cause it was something I was showing y'all. Oh yes. One of the items is an energy drink. And I was talking about when, before I deleted the video, I was talking about, um, how I bought the energy drinks for me to stay up because, um, and that's what kind of prompted me to talk about, you know, work anyway. So I want to tell you guys that before I really get into the grocery haul, I just, I'm so excited. Y'all know how much this means to me. I cannot wait. I start um, the very end of this month. Um, and um, I just, now there's going to be something that happens, right? Between now and the end of the month. I don't want to say until it happens. So I'll let you guys know. But um, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I cannot wait. I keep saying I'm so excited, but I'm so excited. So anyway, let me get to the haul while we're here, okay? Okay, so here we have a Aldi's grocery haul, okay? Now, I know that I said in my last video, one of my last videos, that I wanted to do different kind of content for you guys this year other than uh, grocery hauls. So, of course, I'm still going to incorporate the grocery hauls, but in this moment in time, I felt like I haven't given y'all a grocery haul in a minute. And so in case anybody is curious of what's in my refrigerator, here we go. Um, also, I want you guys to keep on the lookout. I'm going to try my very best. Try my very best, okay? I said try. Just, you know, don't, don't, don't hold me accountable too much. But I'm going to try to um, eat better this year. Me and Amara, um, which is my fault because obviously I feed her. Um, she's getting a little thick around the ankles, okay? She's getting a little thick for her age. And of course, you girl, I've been thick. <laughs> so... I, I really need to make better choices in foods and fast food and stuff like that. Um, you know, it's just, it's, it's more quicker. When you are a single mom, it's just easier to just grab food and come back home than to sit here and have to prepare and all that stuff. Sometimes it's not as easy to just be cooking four course meals, okay? Um, so, and meal prepping and stuff, who finna do that? So, um, yeah, so I'm gonna try my best to buy better things. Exclude this, okay? We're not starting right now. <laughs> But over the course of my grocery hauls, I'm going to try to buy new things. And I won't try to comment in down below and let me know if you notice how my groceries have changed um, and the type of things I've been buying. Okay. So I'm going to try, I'm going to substitute. I'm not going to go like full force, like real restricting mode. I'm going to just, you know, kind of ease my way, like buy things that are like a hundred calories, you know, or zero sugar less sugar like i'm gonna start like that you know i'm not gonna go full force because for me if i do that i'm just gonna i'm, I'm gonna end up quitting so but anyway enough of me talking um let's start so we have the the milk here of course we have our cheese there are a couple things i want to try as far as cooking and one of the things i want to do y'all i want to make some um shrimp and grits like the creole kind so i'm so excited for that um, so that's going to come on the channel one one day. I don't know when, but soon, because I really want to try that. But um, I got some uh, cheese here. I got some turkey breast meat. I was in a mood for like some nice deli sandwiches and chips. Um, I got some iceberg lettuce here. Is this iceberg? No, this is garden salad, but same difference. Um, I like to have these salads with, um, I'm sorry, I like to use this type of lettuce with my 
the the concoction I made on my last video, which is the eggs, the bacon, and lettuce. That's a like a tradition with in my family. Um, that my mom made for us when we were younger and I just kept it going. Um, I like to use this kind of lettuce for that. Um, if I did not say, I think I did, this is an Aldi's grocery haul. I spent $171, I think. I don't know how I'm spending this much money and it's just me and Amara. Like, majority of the stuff though is getting eaten by her though. Like, for real. <laughs> it's getting, she the one that, she's, she's the, she, she's, I can't even talk. It's, it's her. I blame her. Um. <laughs> But okay, so I got this the energy, energy drink set. I'm gonna try. I tried the very first time I started working working overnight, and I stopped because I felt like it wasn't working. But I said, let me just try to do it again, and just knock it, knock this out or whatever. So I'm gonna try that tonight. Um, the energy drinks here. This here. This is the cel Celsius Celsius um, energy drink. Sidebar, somebody told me that somebody, I don't know if this is true or not, but somebody told me that a guy unalived, well, was unal or how can I say, he became unalived, I guess, if you will, um, because he had too many Celsius drinks in one day. They say it's dangerous to drink more than one. I don't know. When I first tried these, I actually had like two one day because I wanted to see if it worked and kept me up all night. It didn't but um i wanted to try and i was fine so i don't know how true that is but um yeah i don't know comment down below and let me know if you've heard any stories okay so then we have some grits here now i like grits and sausage just you know that as, as it is but um when i was looking up the shrimp and grits they said you're supposed to use yellow grits or something like that yellow corn grits or something like that so um anyway but that's just, this is just for me to have. Um, then I have some chicken uh, chicken drummits. I love these chicken drummits. Listen, in the air fryer, it's something about that air fryer, man, I'm, I'm telling you. Um, then I got some eggs, of course. I got my bacon. I got two things of juices for Amara for her uh, school, which I think I didn't tell y'all guys this either, but because I start a new job, um, I'm gonna take her out of her ABA school or I think it's ABC uh, school for her autism. I'm unfortunately gonna have to take her out um, because it's not gonna work with my work schedule and I just unfortunately I'm not able to keep her in there and oh my god I didn't tell you guys this either. Okay hold on intermission. Okay so I don't think I told you guys this either. If I did act like you don't remember but um when I had a conversation with her with the financial advisor or whatever at that that program the school that she goes to I didn't realize that it was thousands of dollars. I did not realize it was thousands of dollars. I think I kind of remember telling y'all this, I don't know. But um, I was like, okay, I can't keep her in here. So I already had planned to kind of take her out because when they were talking about how much it costs, I was like, well, ma'am, uh, mm -mm. but I ended up applying for this program that was based upon income and you can get like a certain percentage. So you can get like 25%, 50%, 75%, 100% um, as far as cost. So let's say your bill is $1,000. If you qualify for the 25%, you get 25% knocked off or you get you know 50% 50, 50 knocked off of your bill, whatever. If you get 100, that means you don't have to pay anything. So by the grace of God, they get ran my information and I qualify for 100%, y'all. I don't have to pay anything for this school that she's been in. Thank you, Jesus, okay, because I did not know how I was gonna get that, I was gonna get that money. Um, so it's just, it took a lot off my plate as far as having to worry about that. So I said, you know, let me just go ahead and, and make the move to get her to back to her daycare. She's gonna go back to the daycare that she was at before because it just, it's not gonna work with my new work schedule. It really isn't. Um, so I just unfortunately have to take, I wish they had night care uh or a night program but they don't um but i think the girl actually said she sent me some information via email about other companies that may offer night programs i don't know but if they do i would love that because i want her to still do this program i think it help is helping her a lot it's just mom gotta work so but anyway okay so get back to the grocery store grocery store Okay, so that's her juice, and then we have, um, I'm going to get back to my smoothies. Oh, I think I didn't show you guys my yogurt over here, and I have my, um, 
bananas i want to get back to doing my smoothie bowls or whatever so i bought those i got some mushrooms i got a bunch of fruit like one thing we do in this house especially amara is eat fruit and so i got a bunch of fruit i got blueberries i got uh blackberries i got raspberries strawberries cherries i think i got grapes right there so we're gonna eat some fruit okay um i got some waffles here and some french toast sticks for the morning i got some bread um i got some jello strawberry strawberry jello got some orange juice sunny d for amara um i got me some tomatoes i want to get back to doing my avocado some things i have a taste for and then some things i don't and like if i'm eating too much of it like all the time it just my taste buds like okay i don't want it anymore and then i kind of revisit it so i haven't had any avocado toast avocados right there i haven't had any in a minute so um i thought you know let me go ahead and bring that back got some oatmeal which I'm going to probably just keep this as like some backup food. I got some um like steel oats over here up here um that I need to I really need to like cook. That reminds me, I want to make some oatmeal cookies. I made some oatmeal cookies and some chocolate chip cookies like years ago, and I think I actually made some here at this house um uh, about a year or so ago, and they were so so good so i'm gonna make some um oatmeal cookies one day from scratch but anyway um got some fruit bars for her i needed some more what's this uh dishwater liquid i got some apple juice for her we got some biscuits over here um i'm trying some new um creamers the this is the i'm actually excited to try this one it's the oat milk cookie creamer um and this is the vanilla by oat creamer so I'm interested to try. I always like to try different flavors of creamer. Um, it should be interesting. I am gonna try to do like the zero sugar um, creamers or however they have it. Um, to just kind of, cause my, I like my sugar, my coffee sweet and I know that's not good. So I'm gonna try to transition to getting like oat milk instead of regular milk and zero sugar creamers instead of the sweet creamers. I'm gonna try y'all, I'm gonna try. Cause I like sweet stuff um cinnamon rolls and then i think that's it oh paper towels we got some bottles of water we had no water left so i definitely needed some water and then over here um she had one of her danimals danimal smoothies already um and then i wanted to try this you know i'm always trying to be like a little bistro okay and they had this called this uh fudge mocha creamer or cold foam definitely want to try that um and then we have the zero calorie uh snacks for amara more fruit pineapples and cantaloupe we definitely got to eat these like here's my thing in the moment i get stuff that i'm like oh i want to eat that but then when i get home i leave it in the refrigerator and forget it and sometimes stuff go bad and especially these two items they always go bad and i'll be so mad because they be so good but i don't eat them in enough time so me and amara have to eat these like asap um because yeah otherwise it'll start stinking and we don't want that um so we have these mood tube low fat yogurts for amara my favorite juices from all these the guava mango i'm telling y'all it's the bomb and the kiwi strawberry baby mm -mm. then i bought some almond milk cho almond chocolate milk for amara i got some animal crackers over here and then we have some turkey ground turkey some sausage Here's some veggie straws. I got some spinach. I like to make spinach, uh, saute mushrooms, which is why I bought the mushrooms, and eggs um, sometimes in the morning. So that's for that. I got some kettle salt, salt and vinegar chips. I got some of the potato chips to go with some French dip that me and my friend or my friend bought last week when she came over here. Oh my God, I got a friend now. Like we haven't even talked about that. <laughs> But anyway, um, I have onions here. I wanted some grilled onions. I got some cuties for Amara, apples for Amara. I got this for Amara, this kid fruit grain, little mini bar things for Amara, more oatmeal. And I think that's it. I think I got everything. Now, I am gonna have to, I actually gotta clean up a little bit down here. I wait uh I didn't waste anything, but you know how sometimes it get a little bit dirty. So I gotta wipe some stuff off, kinda throw some stuff out um before I put the stuff in. So <clears throat> I will do that and I'll show you guys the end results. 
Okay, so we are all put away. Um, I wanted to show you guys this fruit that I put in um, containers before I put it in the refrigerator. And I'll show you guys the, refri the refrigerator. Um, so this idea actually was for my mom. They bought a bunch of containers and stuff. My mom and my sister was like really organized and bought containers and sectional stuff. And to just be a bit more organized, especially my older sister, she is the goat of organization, okay? Um, but anyway, so my mom was doing this when she was living here and I kept the containers or whatever, um, uh, or she let me keep these containers, whatever. Um, but I use them to store my fruit. So, um, I put the raspberries and the blue, uh, raspberries and blackberries here. I got the blueberries and the rest of the strawberries that couldn't fit all in here in the containers. And then I didn't have, I only have two of these, so I need to get more. Um, so I didn't have enough containers to put the grapes and the cherry. So I put them in another container. Um, it just takes away from having like a bunch of plastic bags and all that kind of stuff in the refrigerator. So, um, and if I'm not mistaken, they say it stays a little bit fresh in containers. I could be completely wrong, but overall, if you like the organized look instead of a bunch of bags and stuff like that inside of your refrigerator, not like plastic bags, but you know, the bags that it come in. Um, this may be, you know, just a little bit more pretty, just a little bit, not that much. But anyway, so I put the grapes in here in a container and I'm going to put, uh, well, I did put the cherries in here. Um, so I'm going to put this stuff in the refrigerator. It does have a little hole in it. Um, no, actually this was from when we did, when we had fall, remember we guys had, no, it's fuh. I keep saying fo. It's fuh. Um, this is from the container that, um, the leftover, leftover fuh was in. So... Here's the refrigerator, nice and stocked. Um, I also put the eggs in here. There's a little tray of egg, uh, eggs, I keep my eggs in here. And I just put everything in there nice and neat. Okay, well, you know, I guess as neat as I could be, okay. Um, got things over here, okay. And so I'm gonna put the fruit and stuff down here. Scoot, 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 okay. Now this big boy, should I put in the front? Okay, perfection. And then this little one, we could probably boop, put you right there. Great, perfection. So we got the refrigerator. Ooh, okay, corn. Um, Not that much I put in the freezer. I bought, oh, I didn't show you guys this. I bought some, this little mixture, garlic chicken mixture. Um, I bought two of those and I, there's the, um, waffles and the, the, um, what is that? Stick things. Um, so not too much. I didn't put too much in the freezer. Then I put the chips and stuff all in this little container here, the water and that over there. And I kind of rearranged the cabinet just a little bit, um, to kind of put things in order just a little bit not that much okay so yeah so we're all done okay so that is what i have for you guys today i hope you guys enjoyed um this grocery haul and yeah that's that's all i gotta say okay happy new year happy kwanzaa and yeah tell me guys what you think about no i did okay i forgot i did do another video see i'll be forgetting like i remember some things and then i forget I did do a New Year's Eve video for you guys prior to the Christmas. Okay, and I'll talk about that. So comment down below or even just comment on that New Year's Eve video that I uploaded about um, just about the video, your thoughts, what's your New Year's resolutions, what are you guys gonna try to do differently, change, keep the same, all that good stuff. Let me know um, in the comments on that video down below and I'll catch you guys on another one. Bye.